Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So I have a huge fashion overhaul for you. I've picked up like a few different items this time to try, so without further ado, let's just get straight into the haul. So I'm going to start off with what I'm wearing. I got a green trench faux leather jacket. Really love the colour. I wanted to go for something a bit different. It does have like these little cargo pockets on the front and then it does like have these slits in the side and it's just like a nice lightweight jacket it'll be perfect for like spring autumn like the transitional weather where it's not too hot and it's not too cold a little bit long in the arms we do have a belt with like the belt loops the only thing i will say is that sometimes like because of the material the belt is not going to exactly stay like this just a shame it's a little bit long in the arms but the slits and that i feel like just a bit different let me show you guys let me show you guys the back so yeah, I thought this was a cute little fun piece. Again, dress it up, dress it down. Okay, next up we have this cute little two-piece. So I got this in a size 1X. I forgot to say the jacket before was an extra large. Okay, I'll start off with the jacket first because I do really love the jacket. So if I come a bit closer, you can see it's got some small and big rhinestones on. I feel like you can definitely dress this up, dress this down. If you're going somewhere like more casual for like New Year's, Christmas, obviously when this video goes live it's past that or like for an occasion or anything like that concerts I feel like this is a great fun piece the only thing is, is obviously because I have such a small waist the skirt is quite big on my waist and then it's like tight on the hips so I feel like if they had like a nice stretchy more fitted skirt this would have been perfect but I do really love it as a set together I love the jacket I'll definitely get a lot of use out of the jacket as you can see the skirt is quite short one thing about it is it doesn't rise up which is good but yeah just too big on the waist for me but I do feel like this is a cute little fun set and it's very versatile as well it's been a while since I've tried some of their jeans I've sort of been trying them as sets recently and I really loved the pattern on these ones and I thought like they were very versatile, very me. Um, again, dress them up, dress them down. But they only went up to a size 15 and I normally get like a 14 plus, but even then that can be a little bit big on me. So I thought maybe a 15 will fit. But what I will say is they are quite tight and they're not as high rise as I would like them. So I feel like had they been higher rise, they probably would have been perfect because even though they're a bit tight, it kind of depends what you're doing where you could like wear them to. Um, but you do have front pockets, a zip, button belt loops as you can see the back is just quite low rise on me but i did feel like they were going to be low rise from the picture i am at five foot four they're literally perfect length they come right down to my ankles they do have these in like a red burgundy color but yeah i really love them just a shame they're a bit too snug okay next up we have this two-piece set so i picked it up obviously for the color and i thought it'd be quite cute and just like something easy to throw on or like lounge around and kind of thing but yeah i'm just gonna kind of say i don't really like it the top, again, fits perfect, it is quite loose. I did get this in a size extra large. It's nice and thick, it is a lovely soft material. Yeah, it's just like a dark green with like an apple type green. It's crocheted. And again, same for the cardigan. This is definitely more like oversized. And it's just super long, like it literally touches the floor on me. You definitely need to be a bit taller and maybe I could have sized down because like it is very large and oversized. I don't feel like it's super flattering because it kind of just looks straight on me still soft still comfy if it's your kind of thing snap it up but yeah just for me wasn't quite right we have a little satin shirt which i haven't tried from fashion over in quite a while i do need to do up the sleeves but i just really loved the colors in this it's quite different it's got like rose type flowers on um but yeah they do cuff up quite nicely and they will stay so yeah they're not gonna be too long in the arms for me and yeah i really love it obviously i've just paired it with these for now but I would just pair it with black. Again, it's probably something you can dress up for a nice little meal. And if I show you guys the length, that is the length of it, which I probably wouldn't ever wear like this. I would tuck it in because I kind of like that style to snatch my waist. But yeah, again, it's a satin material, super soft, super nice on the skin. And I did pick this up in a size extra large. Next up, we have this top. You guys know I've picked it up in two colours before. As soon as I obviously saw this Barbie pink, I had to have it. But I messed up and I ordered a 1X instead of an extra large. So it is a little bit big on me and I'm really, really annoyed about it. But I'm going to keep hold of it for now. And then um, hopefully I can order a size down in my next order. But they are quite popular and I think the green has sold out. But they've got a really nice like nudie bronze colour as well, like a neutral colour. Definitely snap it up. Love this. Like I highly recommend it. It's a nice ruched satin material. So soft and comfy. There isn't like loads of stretch in it but there is like good enough room obviously wear a proper bra with it but yeah i love these like i'll probably keep buying all the colors that they bring 
maybe I'll buy the neutral as well. Okay, let's move on to some dresses. The first one is this gorgeous lime green ribbed dress for coming a bit closer. It does have some nice detailing up here. Obviously, just be careful of your boobs. It's a little bit long in the arms, but I could just fold that over. Obviously, this is definitely a dress you dress up. I do have a red fong on underneath, so if you can see that, that's what that is. But obviously, I would wear nude. It's permanent for me. It's like a midi length, sort of halfway in between my calves. So nice, snatches you in a little bit. Um, it's super stretchy, so I don't know, maybe I could have sized down, but I will say like it is quite tight up here, but what I like is it does have sticky bits, so it does kind of help keep it shape and like hold up here. That's what the back looks like. Again, it's not too unflattering on the cellulite. You've got the rib to kind of make it thicker and hide that. Okay, so this is the next one we have. I can't completely do it up, but I, love the colors of this it's a really like nice silky satin material and then like the flowers on it are velvet it is double lined and it does have like slits in the arms because they obviously are long in the arms singes me in so nicely again it's quite like a square neck it's quite wide it does have a zip up the back which i do need to get my boyfriend to do up see if it actually fits me because i wasn't sure if it would do up but it is quite stretchy so maybe it will yeah as you can see it just falls down because it is like so soft and satiny. Yeah, I absolutely love this. Again, it comes right down to my ankles. Oh, I think the only problem with this is that the slit at the back is really high. As you can see, like it's literally right below the bum cheek. So I do feel like you'd have to be super careful because I do feel like something is gonna show. But yeah, it's a shame because it's such like a nice dress, so flattering, love the colors. Um, I don't often wear purple, but I do really like purple on my skin tone. Again, size extra large. Okay, this next one I had really high hopes for. I got it in extra large. So it's this gorgeous red and black velvet dress. It is double lined, but it is kind of like sheer. The arms are mesh, sheer as you can see. So these straps that I've tied up, they're actually supposed to, one arm is supposed to tie together and have a strap here, tie together and have a strap here, but the straps do not stay. Like, even when you look at it on the website, on the Fashion Over model, now that I've looked again, they look like they've really stretched them over to like keep them staying. They just don't stay. So I was kind of like thinking, how can I do something to help them stay or maybe just tie them at the sides here but i've just done that for now because i feel like it gives me some support it holds it up but it is just like a nice cow neck snatches me in it's just so nice it really does give me like valentine's day kind of vibes extravagant date night anniversary turn around you can see the back obviously the strap doesn't technically go across there but that's what I've done. It does have a hidden zip at the side. So I'll show you the bottom because it is flowing, it is quite long. So that's what the bottom looks like. So it does literally touch, but obviously you'd be wearing heels so it would lift it up. But yeah, I absolutely love it. I think this is so classy, so nice. It's just a shame about the straps. But like I said, you could probably do something like what I've done and make it work in some way. Okay, next up we have this gorgeous red dress. I love this. The only thing is I wish it was longer because it is very silky. It's double lined, it rises up, and it is just like short anyway. Um, but it has these nice like bell flare sleeves. We've got the long slits in them, so they're not gonna be annoying, like they'll move out your way. It does have like some soft shoulder pads in to kind of give structure. Um, like I said, it's double lined, it's rhinestoned. I love it so much. It snatches you in. As you can see, like that layer is mesh. And the back has like a little button, it is open back does have like a little hidden zip if you need help, but you can literally just slide this on. But like I said, it's super short on me. I wouldn't feel comfortable wearing it just because it's gonna ride up. But like I said, if it was longer, it would have been literally perfect. I've got the perfect bag to go with it. I've got the perfect shoes to go with it. It'd be all like rhinestoned out. But yeah, just unfortunately too short on me. But if this works for you, then like definitely get it. Like don't miss out on it. Okay, next up we have a jumpsuit. Now this is a knitted jumpsuit. It's so soft and comfortable. I haven't properly done it all the way up just because it is like a little bit hard when I'm by myself. But I have tucked the sleeves under because it is a little bit long in the arms. It's nice in the high neck. And it's just like a really weird fun print. I feel like it's given eyeballs. Um, but yeah, it's very bright and bold. But yeah, you guys know I love black and green. It's literally like the perfect length for me. I wouldn't say it's tight to the ankles. It's like a little bit loose, but it's not flared or anything, but at least it's a good length as well because sometimes they can be too long. It does have a zip that you can do it, like I said. And the only thing is, I will say, it doesn't like exactly stick to my back. I think the last time I got a jumpsuit was an extra large and it was really tight. So yeah, I'm just glad this is like different. Okay, so next we have this two-piece. So I wasn't really sure if this would fit, what the material would be like, but it just looks so nice on the model. Like I had to try it and I just thought it was a very fun 
bold out there piece that I would wear to work. So the blazer is like a, I think it's a polyester material. It has stretch to it, which I love. This is the type of material I had in previous sets, blazer sets. And yeah, they're just so comfortable. Like this is really nice and soft. These are well made as well. It's slightly long in the arms. It doesn't have a button to do it up, which I quite like because sometimes that can be stretchy, but I could literally just add a button if I really wanted to. But yeah, I feel like it's super flattering. It has fake pockets. And then the bottoms are stretchy. They've got an elastic waist. I've got it in a size extra large, if I forgot to mention. The only thing is, I will say that on my bum area, it is sheer because, it, like on the black bit, um, because it does stretch. But I definitely wouldn't have wanted to size up like an extra large if it's perfect. If I come close, maybe you can see. It's just a bit sheer, but I feel like, because this is going to cover... It's literally fine. So this is where it sucks slightly because the bottoms are way too long. They are flared, but I've got a woman that lives near me that like charges like 12 pounds or something to hem the bottoms. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna pin them myself, get her to hem them, because she's literally around the corner. Um, because I do really love this. I wanna keep it, I wanna wear it. The bottoms don't have any pockets or anything. Definitely dress this up, dress it down. I feel like it, the color of the flowers and the colors on here kind of gives like wedding vibes as well in a way if you like to wear these kind of things to weddings so to finish it off i wanted to try some shoes from fashion nova now a bit of a disaster so i originally was going to get a smaller size because they have two different size charts on their website one that says a seven is a uk five and a six is a uk five so i went for the seven because that's kind of what i've got in other shoes and stuff um so it's gonna be no surprise that my shoes are pink so I wanted to try some boots. So they're stiletto heels and they've got like this nice sole. They are very well like made, they're sturdy, they're suede. Um, and then it does have like rhinestones on. The only thing I will say is that the laces being rhinestone is a little bit, not tacky. It's just if you're very thingy about stuff like that, you can kind of see it's not like the greatest thing, but on laces, like they're gonna probably come off and stuff anyway. It does have a zip to get it on. It comes with like, liners in just the only thing is they don't fit me like my calves are too big they fit perfect like foot wise they are probably a bit more snug but yeah even undoing all the laces which does take a while because the rhinestones kind of grip on the sides they just don't really fit which is such a shame because they are so cute and then i got another pair of pink boots to try because i really wanted to try pink cowboy boots so i'm only going to get one out again so i got these like metallic shiny pink cowboy boots um, again, they're very well made. I didn't expect them to have like a nice, like thick sole. They are quite pointy. They are tight to get on. These literally fit, but again, they're just snug, like everywhere. Um, they don't really have like any stretch to them either. But yeah, they're so cute. I'm like kind of guided that they don't really fit. So I think I'll probably just stick to trying like heels and sandals on there maybe because boots are just a no-go, but I've seen loads of plus size women wearing the boots from Fashion Nova and they look so good. So. I need to ask them, I need to know what the secret is. So yeah, they were two of the boots that I got to try, but unfortunately not very successful. But I'm thinking I might give these pink cowboy ones a try because they're just snug overall. So yeah, that is everything I got. I do love pretty much everything I picked up. I think there's just some issues with some of the pieces. If I have to recommend anything, I do really love this set. Um, I do love the red dress, the red and black dress. Obviously that pink top, guys, snap that up, it's so nice. And I do really like the rhinestone jacket. Like that as a set is so nice. So if the sets will fit you, and you don't really have like a small waist, snap it up. But yeah, I will leave the links to everything down below if you do wanna check any of them out. Let me know in the comments below which was your favorite and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.